Hello everyone, did you know you can access your Wichita University LMS account in an app? Let's get started. Like, it's an application, you can access your LMS account and everything you've done before using your Chrome, say, Opera, Phonics browser and everything in just a single tap. Like, the application is from the Play Store, so you just come and type in Wichita University LMS app. Yeah, it gives you different options. So if I've tried out this model, it works, this VCTM works, many of these work. But the problem is, they require you to sign in using your email address, like the university email address. What's special about the VCTM LMS app, this specific one, is that for it, you just use your student number and password and everything will be set. So you just go to your Play Store, install the application. It's not much big, as you can see. And it's having kind of poor rating, but it's all fine. The guy does not know how to rate the application, but it's fine. Like 34 reviews, it's nice. For me, if I'm giving it, I will be giving it a 5-star rating. In case it's having a 6, so well. The application works efficiently so far for the time I've used it. So you can access everything. What's special about this? Even if you have no internet connection, but your phone is connected to the internet, like you have no data on your phone, but you have your data connection turned on you can access your account and everything will be finished like even if i have zero mbs of data i can access everything so long as i turn on my internet connection so after installing the application just open from your play store gives you like you see my university they want wonderful, wonderful you know it's the best university we have so far in uganda yeah you can check in from your username, this is my username, like it's my student number and then the password. I've logged in before so it remembers me and I save the password. So I just tap in. In case you've not, you have to type in your username and everything like the way you use it on your Chrome, right? Then you log in. In case you forgot your username or password, you know the process. It may be kind of difficult but it's, it has to come to an end and you have to access your account as well, right? So you log in. Right now I'm connected to the internet and that's because it's the start like the moment I log out of the internet, say I have no internet connection or say that something like that, I can access everything. You begin with your dashboard, right? And here you can access everything you've done before, like say this ICD practical for me, it's the only paper I've done so far, so it has to give me something like that. Check this. Everything you've ever done before using, say, a laptop or from a cafe or anything, so long as it is associated with your LMS account, it accesses it, right? Yeah. Check this out. All the chats, you can access them right here. And you can say, check on the previous messages, check on your contacts. Right now, I have no contacts, so you may be having some. I have some few here. You can even try to text someone say you give them some message and they will access it when they are back online like they when they log in right here we have the three bars where you can access your account like you can edit the account you can check from the from the chrome it's kind of hard and difficult to access the account but say changing your credentials and everything like that but here you can access everything in just a swift like yeah say changing your profile picture everything is just the notifications right now i have no you can access the university calendar and many more which will be described in our next videos this was just an eye open about the app and if you like the video give that the thumbs up comment say to comment about the video so it's nice or something like that yeah Thanks for watching and subscribe for more videos about this application because it's, it's getting me nice like